don't buy this game because this is absolutely all it is. <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I am your humble narrator, and welcome to another Dayton Dissects. This is ga this is a game called Zenbound 2. It is all about tying up little wooden animals. <laughs> Does that sound weird? Sounds like two sexual fetishes mixed together. Let's check out the tree of introduction. Touch a hanging wooden tag to begin a level. Oh, it's gonna be so fun. Looks like a little bird. So, you take your bird, and you spin him. And you got this rope, and you gotta kinda try and hook it on to the best part in order to wind the rope up further. I'm gonna try to stick it between his feet like that. Yeah, totally. Probably would be better to... <laughs> oh, that's alright. Probably would be better to use maybe the wings or something. Minimum goal reached. And I would just spin it like this. Medium goal reached. Oh yeah, we're doing it. Tie up the glowing nail to finish. How to do it. Okay, that's it, right? I assume that this would be much better on a touch screen. If you've got a touch screen computer, the game might be worth picking up. But for me, it handles kind of awkwardly, even though it feels like uh, completely tactile and everything. It's just hard to do something like this with a mouse. But hooray, we did do it. In the end. Alright. Two flowers collected. The path upward is lit. Nail bombs. Oh, wanna be fun? I threw a nail bomb in a preschool one time. It was fun. That's not a fun thing to say. It's not a good thing to joke about. And I say unsubscribe right now. It's only gonna get worse. So, I'm not sure if you're supposed to blow these pins up to coat the moose in paint. But I'm going to do it because this is how we learn, right? Right. Do it. Oh yeah, Super Moose. You're gonna get tied up real good. Oh, 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 oh! We're gonna lose it. I'll oh, fart. No, no, no! Spin the moose faster! We can recover everything! Oh yeah, get the feedies! Nice! Oh, this kind of blopped off though. Okay. And then there's one like under his stupid moose face. Come here, moose face! I'm gonna get you! I have to tie the glowing nail. How to do? I guess you gotta like touch it. Go on, touch it. Hey, <laughs> that's what she said. What are you talking about? I don't know. I'm just trying to tie this moose up with string. We're out of string now. We have no more string left to tie the moose up. Ah. This game has pushed me to my limits. Why does it get darker? Is this rope connected to my brain stem? Seizure! Okay, I guess I gotta unwrap my moose a little bit. <laughs> it's kind of a game that's uh, complex, but not in a way that's very challenging. It's good if you just want to turn your brain off play something casual for a little while. Is this rope, like, super sticky or what? It doesn't seem like it's unraveling like regular rope. So I knock points off of that. Oh, who am I kidding? I don't give points to games, really. Oh shit, I almost had it. Uh, 
If you want to try this game for yourself, you can. It uh, is a browser game as well. So I'm going to leave a link in the description. If you want to tie up little animals. <laughs> it's not weird, trust me. You can trust me. Come on. Come on, rope. Do the thing you do. Ah, oh, fuck. I hate this moose. What a dick. You think this is uh, how I wanted to spend my lovely Sunday? It's actually Friday night. But by the time you watch this, it'll be Sunday. I just wanted to connect with you. Make you feel like uh, we're together on a real level. Which I think we are. You know, even if you don't want to take me out to dinner or anything. That's fine, though. With time. I think I screwed up that paint thing already. Tie up the glowing nail to finish the level. I'm not very good at that part. See, that's the part I'm having trouble with. Help me, Mr. Moose. Just spin it like that. Yeah! Well, okay. That was a thing, I guess. What's next? Stupid hippo. Nah, you're not stupid, are you, hippo? You're not. Just fat. Because you're fat, people think you're stupid. That's not the case, is it? I know better. Um... So I do like the different wooden animals. And I like the different colors that they're painted. And if that's not enough to keep you entertained, then don't buy this game. Because this is absolutely all it is. <laughs> you kinda just gotta puzzle out how to tie the animal up the quickest. And I think I finally got the swing of it. Oh, one more. I wanna tie up a dodo bird. Or a duck. Whatever the hell this is. Oh, look, you paint them yellow, like a real duck. Are hippos black? Don't answer that. Oh, this is like... I have to paint him. That's a different challenge than just uh, tying him up. Hooray! So, friends, this has been Zenbound. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. The comment of the week goes to Diamond Deb, who left some love on my Left 4 Dead 2 videos. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.